DIY for you and it's really hot out here so yeah. Um, basically the materials you're going to be needing and me and my brother are going to be doing this video so it's a crafty with bros since we haven't done it in a while and oh, materials you're going to need are water guns, um, basically Dollar Tree water guns pretty much. So yeah, um, we're using this water balloon squirt thing to put the water inside the water guns and mix it with the watercolor, the paint and stuff. So you're gonna need this. Um, you're gonna need several print, several pieces of printer paper, which is fun. So you're gonna need printer paper. Then you're going to need. Then you're gonna need some paints, different kinds of paint. I mean, we've tried, we're gonna try our watercolor, see if it works. Some washable kids paint. I don't know. See that? Yeah. Um. And we're using regular paints from what I use on most of my uh, most of my painting videos. So yeah. Basically, that's all the materials you need for this video, and I really hope you guys enjoy it. So, guys, um, basically, we are going to put the water in the guns now. So, right now, um, we're kind of noobs at this, so it's our first time trying it. We're going to see how it works. We're going to try different ways and see how it comes out. My brother is now putting the water in the water guns, and yeah. You don't have to use these type of water guns, but we thought we could use them and just for the price. Yeah. And we have a problem. <laughs> Hold the camera. <laughs> I don't think it has anything to do with it. So I think we put enough water, it's all the way to the top. How are we putting the paint in? Uh, we're gonna put the paint in. We're gonna try these types of paint. Are you gonna use the end or something? These types. Wait. <laughs> this, is, this is a try and error. Back up. All right, so hold the gun. <laughs> We're gonna try these paints. This one is the glitter kind, so it comes with glitter as well. So, what color? It's called purple. Okay. <laughs> Are we just gonna dip the brush in? Oh, I just burned myself. Do we, I don't know, do we try it this way or this way? No, I don't know what we're doing. Did you watch a video on this? No. I saw a picture. Ugh. I think we should have put less water. Just a tad. Yeah. Less water. Less water. Okay. I'm just gonna put a whole bunch of that in there. This is a messy process. Really messy. Um, I don't even think what's going in the gun. It is. That's why I say use Dollar Tree or like Dollar Store water guns and watery paint. I think acrylic paint two paints would work better with this, but I don't have that, so. Okay. It's coming out. Purple. We need paper, though. I know. So, go get the paper. And I'm getting messy. Fire! So, it's actually working. That's pretty awesome. <laughs> um, I'm gonna put more paint and see how it works out. And then we will be trying it together. <laughs> and my hands are all messy. And I would be sure to have some napkins near you.
So, um, me and my brother actually uh, made a mess of ourselves, if you can see. Hey, uh. And we actually accomplished putting the paint in here. But I would really suggest if you had acrylic paint or even like tube paints, it would probably be a much easier process. But of course, we went the hard way. And we just, I don't know, it, it's, we just used the supplies we had around our house and made it work. So it's pretty affordable since we just grabbed the materials materials from Dollar Tree. And um, yeah, so hold yet. the camera oh. while I show them. Um, so basically we used, um, for the purple, we used this washable kids paint, and um, using the washable kids paint, I literally just did this repeatedly into the water gun, and then after you could just shake it up a bit and put a napkin on top and shake it, and basically you'll start, if you squirt it out, you'll have a pigment, and it'll, it's actually really cool, we tested it out on our paper here and it actually came out really good so um what comes really in handy if you go to dollar tree and you get the water balloons that the little tube things like we have this whole thing and it have water balloons and it actually comes with the water and it is fit with our if like the, the shooting thing i don't know what you call it nozzle yeah um it fit it did fit um in the water gun for us to squirt water or you can easily just use i don't know some kitchen tools to put the water in there but we actually had this and it came in handy so yeah and then we tried using watercolors which really didn't work out how we wanted to it was just less pigmented for us so um what we did we just cracked some up of the similar colors and just dropped them in our water guns and it kind of came out good but i really don't suggest using watercolors for this project i would suggest using paints like this of some sort so yeah my brother used a turquoise type green and i use a purple and we use different brands like i use this one which was from dollar tree or whatever Crayola. yeah and my dad my dad my <laughs> dad my brother used the ones from hobby lobby so yeah it came in handy these guns are actually work they do work but this is a messy process so i do suggest you using napkins and a lot of paper for your area where you want to do so now me and my brother are just going to um, squirt the guns on the paper. So that's what we're going to do right now. And here we go. Here's my brother being a weirdo. Uh, go ahead. Fire! So most safe. You see the pup. <laughs> and this is actually a fun, really fun project to do actually during springtime, fall, or even the summer and I best suggest doing these projects during the summertime with your siblings or anyone really. And my brother's just being a weirdo. And I'm gonna squirt some. So mosaic. You see the Pablo Picasso in it? <laughs> so there's our our art. Oh my god. It works. <laughs> oh my god. He just drowned it. Now put some of this paint on the other paper. You're about to see a masterpiece. This is how I'm going to introduce myself to the art world. I'm going to put the paper on the grass before you just make a mess. Charlie, you gotta shoot it. Alright, that's it. That's enough. That's enough of that. So, my oh my god. Down. So, yeah, that's pretty much that. He was just being a weirdo and made a mess on the freaking concrete. That water which is um ridiculous but yeah it's a pretty cool fun project i'm going to shoot the grass purple because everything needs to be purple purple i'm going to shoot him purple i'm just playing i won't <laughs> but yeah thank you guys so much for watching me and my brother really do appreciate it and um yeah give it a big thumbs up if you liked uh, us being weird and doing more craft projects and if you would like for me to show my face more often I plan on doing it more often in my videos and he's being really rude and I'm going to shoot him with the paint gun should I should I do it should I do it should I, should I'm just playing I barely touched you <laughs> anyways thank you guys so much for watching much love towards everyone I really hope you enjoy this fun project and just have fun, be messy, and yeah. Swag. Bye, guys.
Oh